Okay guys, uh, it's getting pretty near the uh, end of the year now, well, middle of September anyway, and uh, I just thought I'd do um, sort of like Hot Toys figures of the year so far, and um, as you can see uh, these are like my number one and two at the moment, it's uh, obviously the uh, DX08 uh, Joker, Jack Nicholson from the 1989 movie, and um, uh, Batman played by Michael Keaton from uh, the same film, and uh, yeah, um, as I say, um, just got them out uh, displayed on uh, my cabinet. All the accessories down there, he's um, got a grappling gun as well and a few other accessories on his uh, little belt there. Uh, and the Joker's um, holding on to his cane and um, the chattering teeth. Um, and as you can see here, here's the um, other accessories the Joker comes with. Um, possibly um, slightly um, more and better accessories with the Joker figure and um, I don't know maybe I'd, I'd just put the Joker um, ahead um, I don't know he's um, I don't know, got a bit more character about him I feel um, than the Batman guy uh, Batman is like also and all that completely accurate to how um, the Batman was in the 89 film but um, I don't know just personal preference um, has the Joker just nudging in front uh, as I said, it's um, middle of September now, and um, of course the year's not over yet, and um, uh, we have uh, a couple more DXs uh, coming out, as um, some of you might know, uh, obviously the uh, DX11 and uh, the DX12. Um, I think the DX11 is the um, uh, 2.0 uh, Heath Ledger Joker, and um, the DX12 is uh, the... Um, the Dark Knight um, Batman from the the um, latest film and um, uh, which was released this year uh, so that would be interesting um, to see uh, they're shaping up really, really good those figures um, see how they are uh, be compared to the um, DX01 and DX02 uh, looks like um, they're of a superior quality obviously the um, tailoring from the is um being done uh, by um Kato um doing the uh, tailor and that guy so that, uh, that looks like it's going to be a fantastic figure but as it stands these are my top two really and um I think any uh one six um hot toys aficionado has these in their collection if they can um it'd be nice to get the um Batmobile as well which hot toys is um Gonna release, but um, I don't know. I think I'm gonna hold out for that because um, obviously it'd be nice and it kind of like complete the set really. Um, but uh, what we've hot to is announcing the Back to the Future um, license. You got to imagine that a DeLorean is gonna be um, in the um, in the uh, pipeline, so uh, I might hold out for that. Really, I'd rather have a DeLorean uh, than a um, Batmobile from the '89. Um, film uh, uh, ideally but yeah um, see if we can get any uh, close up shots of this uh, these figures they uh, revolve around and uh, just on their DX stands which is nothing spectacular just the logo there um, uh, looks like um, the uh, the other DX's DX11 and 12 are going to come on similar just um, kind of like basic stands. Um, obviously, it's a little bit better than your um, standard uh, Hot Toys base, but it's nothing spectacular. Just look at the little accessories, which and the hands, which mainly just sit in the box, uh, like untouched. I've had uh, the Joker um, with um, the various guns in his hands at one time or another, and holding. Uh, bundle of the um, cash and the notes and the remote controls but I've had him in this pose um, just the one hand holding the cane and the one hand uh, outstretched like that just um, with the um, chattering teeth on them I actually bought another chattering teeth um, let's go down there you don't actually get to um, just bought that separately and uh, a little flower obviously we've got the pair uh, the pair system going on here um, which allows for the um, eyeball movement um, which is a bonus, uh, you only get them with the uh, DX figures uh, so far 
and uh, and yeah so um, that's certainly my own vote for the figures of the year so far um, some people might have a, a different point of view um, I choose different figures uh, and um, maybe say that I'm being biased because of um, it's a DX figure and stuff like that and maybe DX figures should come in their own category but I don't know um, I don't want to be too uh, like pernickety and all that so uh, yeah as it stands um, 2012 um, what sort of figures well yeah figures of the year um, Joker 89 and uh, Batman 89, DX08 and DX09. So cool.